Drapery folds act as pathways for the eye to move through, in, and around a composition. Some folds roll like brooks, meandering over the countryside, while others act as major throughways designed to transport to the heart of a city. The diaper fold is one of the softest, most complementary folds found in necklines. The fashion world concedes that this type of fold is complementary to most face shapes. Its soft, billowing leading lines transport the viewer's eye from the face to the figure, that being a subordinate element to the portrait. The diaper fold occurs when fabric sags between two points of support. The point of intersection is the lowest and most curved or sharpest point found in this type of fold. Its shape depends on the nature of the fabric and the location of the points of support. Its point of intersection appears symmetrical when the points of support are symmetrical in location. This is evident in Thayer's painting entitled Angel. Whereas, in Waterhouse's painting, Cleopatra, one can see that the points of support are slightly offset, as the clavicle is slightly tilted in this seated pose, causing the point of intersection to be off-center and asymmetrical in a likewise fashion. I love perusing the art history books, where these fold types are evident in classical, Byzantine, and medieval art, where robes, cloaks, and Grecian gowns are prevalent. Stay tuned for part three of the Anatomy of Drapery. See you there.